Hey guys, on today's video, I'm going to show you how to fix this problem. It's not just with Facebook, it can be with any app, and it can be on your iPhone, iPad, or Apple Touch. It's the same fix, whichever device you guys have. Exactly the same. So again, if you're having this problem, where your app is not opening up, it could be Netflix, YouTube, Snapchat, Instagram, Facebook, any app, it doesn't really matter. It's the same fix for all of them. So the first thing we have to do is make sure it's up to date. So go into your app store. In your app store, you're gonna look up here, will be your name, just tap up there. And from there, if you scroll down, you will see updates. So just make sure to update everything in here. So I'm just gonna press on update all and that might fix everything. So you might be good just by doing that. So we can just press done and let it update. However, if you're still having problems like me right now, if I open this up, it's still glitching out, it's not working. The next thing would be to just turn off our iPhone, iPad or touch and then turn it back on. So we can do that from settings, for example. So if we go to settings, just scroll all the way down where it says general and under general, you will see your last thing where it says shutdown. So if I tap on shutdown, for example, I'm going to see this and I can just slide it through. So I'm not going to do that right now because I actually don't want to fix it this way because I want to show you if you still have problems, what's the last fix. And the last fix for this would actually be deleting the app itself and re-downloading it. So to delete it, just hold your finger on top of it until you see delete app. That's going to be an option here and we're going to delete it. Once it's deleted, go to your app store and download it again. If you're having problems downloading the app, except maybe with older iPhones, iPad or touches, it's just not compatible. Just go into your purchase history section and download it from there. I do have a separate video showing you how to do that, but that's basically the trick. Just go into your purchase history and downloading it from there. Right now, what I'm going to do is just re-download Facebook. So re-download from there. Again, if you're having problems, you can't download it because it's saying not compatible. Don't worry, you can go into your purchase history and download it from there, not from within this area like I just did. So just to show you that, for example, in this setup, up here would be your name or your picture. Just tap up there. Once you tap up there, you will see purchased. That's going to be your second option. So just tap on purchase. So here it's loading right now because I have a ton of apps that I purchased. Oh, finally that downloaded. Um, so right now, I can see them all and I can just repurchase them. Okay. So whether they were free or paid for, they would be under this section. For example, if it's not working. So right now Facebook is downloading. We're going to wait for that and then open it up from here. So once it downloads, I can always press on open from here. However, I want to show you from the home screen. So here's Facebook up again. So I can just press on Facebook and this time it should actually work. So I can just click on whichever login I have and go into it and I'm done. However, you guys could see that it didn't lag out this time. Anyways, that would be it for this video. If you guys have any comments, questions, you guys can write down here in the comments area. And don't forget to subscribe and rate. Thank you.